again, it's Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the HD-80A sound level meter. Comes with the unit itself, a nice little zipper holder, and an instruction manual talking about all the specs of this device. Uh, this has a range of 40 to 130 decibels, and it has two ranges. 40 to 100 is the first range, 60 to 130 is the second range has a half inch LCD display. The response time is really quick. It's less than a half of a second. It's accurate to plus or minus one and a half decibels. It has um, data hold for maximum and minimum to show you auto power off. The frequency range that it works with is 31.5 to four kilohertz. So keep that in mind. This, this shouldn't be used for higher frequencies than what is typically in your mid range and your subwoofers and your bass speakers. It takes a 9 volt battery, you get about 50 hours of use. Uh, uses A weighting on the frequency scale and uh, has a half inch condenser electric microphone up front and it'll work between 32 and 104 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, on the bottom of this, it has a nice 1 quarter 20, and what I like to do is I use one of these tripods and they're great for holding this for taking your measurements. Um, if you turn this thing on, you just pulse the power switch and it comes on right there and you can see it's responding to my voice. It's picking up uh, what I'm saying, testing one, two, three. You have a hold or it'll hold where it's at at 73.4, then you got minimal and maximum on there. To turn it off, you just push that button there. These are much more accurate than the apps that you have on your cell phone. Now on the back of this, you slide this back and it takes your standard nine volt battery, which is included in this kit. So this is a great device. Um, I'm gonna show you some footage of me using it to test a subwoofer speaker next. I have a DB meter. I have a line input signal that I recorded of a uh, test tone that goes from 20 Hertz to 300 Hertz. And we can look at the decibels here. So I'm going to hit play. It starts off at 20. So there's the decibels. So it starts to roll off after 250 hertz, which is... So what are my thoughts on the sound liver meter, the HT-80A? I think this is a great value. It's not expensive. It seems to be fairly accurate. And when you're setting up speaker systems, subwoofers in particular, you really want to have a sound level meter to get the levels just right, to get rid of some of those peaks and valleys in the audio. So this is a great value. I'm gonna give this product a full five-star rating on my channel. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.